Hi everyone. So we are going to watch our math video for today. We are making shapes from other shapes today. Look at this shape. Which color of pattern block matches this shape? Which color? Good yellow. It's a hexagon. The yellow pattern block matches this shape. This shape is a hexagon. It has six sides. Now look at this hexagon. What color shape was placed at the bottom? Good blue. It was a blue shape. The blue shape was placed at the bottom. Let's place another blue shape on the hexagon. How many blue shapes are covering the hexagon now? One, two. Two blue shapes are covering the hexagon now. Now you can see that all of the hexagon is covered with blue shapes. How many blue shapes were used to make the hexagon? One, two, three. Very good. Three blue shapes were used to make the hexagon. You can see how to make a hexagon from other shapes. All right, let's move to our math math. Alrighty, so folks, this will be a little bit difficult if you don't have pattern blocks at home. If you do have them, I'd love for you to use them. If you don't, that's all right. The main idea for this one is to take this trapezoid and try and build a hexagon. And then here you take a triangle and you try and build a hexagon. All right. How many trapezoids to make a hexagon? How many triangles to make a hexagon? Another activity you can do is to take an index card or a piece of paper, a small piece of paper, cut it into three pieces and then put it back together. All right. So we took three small pieces, stuck them together, and made one big rectangle. If we go in the inside, again, if you don't have the pattern blocks, this can be really difficult. But what you're going to do is you're going to look at the shape. This is a triangle, and this is a trapezoid. And if you draw a triangle on top of your trapezoid, about the same size as this one, you get one, two, this one's upside down, and three triangles make one trapezoid. So then you write the number three right here. For the square, you can draw the square on top of your rectangle. It's not going to go all the way across because it's a square right here. And you can draw another square and you get two squares make one rectangle. All right. And then you can give it a shot down here with the trapezoid and parallelogram. You can do the triangles and the four sided shapes. And then you could try it with this big stretched out rhombus to try and build this shape. And when write how many you use, try your best since you don't have the blocks. Um, ask an adult for help if you need it. All right, folks, have a great night.